blessing on these bikes and open up this season of riding, right? May the sun rise up in front of you. May the rain fall behind you. And the wind follow beside you. May God guard your travels. For the Lord knows the road ahead of you. Keep these riders safe, O oh Lord, through swirling turns and rolling. Let the evil guide them to the mountain tops. Let the moonlight guide them through the mountains. I came out to the Fallen Angels bike run to help raise awareness to friends and family that addiction is real and it is affecting our city, our family members, and many people who, you know, we don't even know. And we'd like to make everybody aware that there's means to get help and that there are ways to, you know, battle your addiction. The Anthony Cavallini house is um, classified as a sober house, but it's so much more than that. Um, for me, it's a, it's a home, it's a family, and we treat it as such. The, the guys here, they help each other out. Um, they're battling their own addiction. They have um, been clean from substance abuse for different amounts of time. The longest one is um, 28 months to the gentleman who may just have a month. Well, my husband loves motorcycles and when he passed away, he left me his motorcycle and um, I converted it into a trike, three wheeler. And um, I know how much he loved riding. So I wanted to do once again, something that symbolized him and uh, a sense of freedom. And for me, it was freedom of addiction, freedom of everything. And that's what writing symbolizes to me.